providing key insights into your customer service operations has always been very important for us. And we've always felt that we've had one of the best solutions in the market, but we also wanted to do better. So over the last three years, yes, we have invested in a new generation of solution that provides the, the ease of use and the zero learning curve that is our ambition for all Zendesk products. Furthermore, this new solution is just the beginning of what kind of data analytics and customer insights we want to provide to our customers in the future. And you're gonna see some very ambitious plans uh, from us to make it easy for you to pipe any kind of customer information inside or outside into uh, this new system. So um, introducing Zendesk Explore, our new analytics tool. It lets anyone in your organization measure and improve the customer experience and measure and improve the customer service operational metrics. Since we launched our beta program, beta program this summer, we have given more than 20,000 customers access to Explore, and we're very, very excited to announce today that it's now generally available. <laughs> so with Explore, we give you access to all the data across all the channels that you're using to interact with your customers. So it works built natively within Sendesk, and it works natively with all Sendesk products, including the suite, or with any combination of our individual, individual products and channel. It, um, you get a bunch of pre-built dashboards right out of the box based on you know, industry best practices, based on all our conversation with you guys, so you can start analyzing your data instantly. It's already populated, and you can hit the ground running with all the data from all the Sendesk products. And we also know that a lot of you have a lot of your own data that you want to pipe in, and you capture a lot of unique data about your customers. And with Send and Explore, you can easily build all of your own KPIs using your own data, your own metrics, build your own dashboards, create your own charge, and build custom dashboards uh, relevant to your business. And lastly, we also let you take all of these insights and share them with the rest of the organization with just a single click, either on a one-on-one -on -one basis or on a regular schedule. So without further ado, let's look and see what uh, Explore looks like in action. And welcome Lisa Kant to come up and talk a little bit more about that. I hope you came back from your scooter ride. <laughs> hey, Lisa. Terrific, all right, let's take a look at the product. So this is Explore, and what we're looking at here is a customer satisfaction dashboard that our team has built, bringing in data from across all of our Zendesk products. I can see things like average CSAT, CSAT by week or last agent touch. I can even see a list of my top customers and who's most likely to churn. Now, I look at this dashboard every day, and I immediately notice that there's something going on with our weekly CSAT. So I'm gonna zoom in here to our weekly CSAT chart and take a look. It seems like CSAT is trending downwards, and in fact, Explore has forecasted that that's gonna continue. Clearly a problem, something I wanna investigate further. Well, I don't need to wait weeks for my analyst team to bring me back a chart. I can actually interact with Explore right here and uncover what's going on. So I'm gonna use Explore's interactive charting features to drill in and understand what's going on with the data. I can drill in by any metric or attribute available to me. In this case, let's look at channel to understand how CSAT's doing across our different channels. I'm gonna pick channel and right away, uh, I'm gonna get an updated chart showing me our CSAT across the different channels. Clearly there's an issue with one channel and that's chat. So I'm gonna to continue to dig in to see what's going on. I'll drill in again. This time, let's look at this by hour to see what's going on for our chat channel across the day. So when I, uh, when I click on hour, immediately I get a new chart. We can see here that there's clearly a problem on a subset of uh, hours. Between the hours of about, it looks like uh, eight and 10, we're really having issues with our CSAT and it's below the norm. So this could be a number of different issues. I could have a workflow routing issue, uh, perhaps a productivity issue, or maybe it's just agent staffing. 
Well, to really understand what's going on, I'm gonna go into Explorer's Chart Builder, where I can do a whole host of complex things. I can customize my charts and dashboards, I can add in a metric or attribute, I can even add in a new data set. I'm gonna pick a metric, which is first response time. And immediately when I choose that, we can see Explorer's updating again with a new best fit chart. I'm looking here at our CSAT by first response time, and it clearly looks like there's an issue. As soon as our first response times go up, CSAT's going down. So there's one final thing I'm gonna do, and that's share that with someone in the company who can do something about it. So I'm gonna click share, send them a note, and I'm actually gonna schedule a refresh so we get a reminder every day until this issue is solved. So in just a few minutes, you've seen us identify an issue, uncover the problem, and actually share it with someone in the company who can do something about it. That's the power of analytics with Zendesk Explorer. Fantastic, thank you so much, Lisa. It's, um... You, Michael. It's really great to see how easy it is to dig into uh, analytics with Explore, and we are making Explore available today. It's available to all new customers yep. for $9 per agent. That's correct. Uh, exactly, and for what about current customers? It's actually available to all current customers, and regardless of um, your size, if you are using uh, Zendesk Explore, uh, sorry, if you're using Zendesk Pro or Enterprise today, you are gonna get grandfathered in to Zendesk Explore. So Explore is free of charge. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Thanks, Lisa. Michael. Excellent. You're welcome. <laughs>